Hello viewers, I am Mike Lee. In the 11th Max, Matrices and Determinants, Exercise 7.4, first sum in the video. Question paranga, find the area of a triangle whose vertices are 0, 0, 1, 2, 4, 3. So, vertices of a triangle are 0, 1, 2, 4, 3. So, vertices of a triangle are 0, 1, 2, 4, 3. This is the determinant area. Kandu. Yer kandu vandu, vertices are 0, 1, 2, 4, 3. We can see the formula in the formula. And the determinant is 0, 1, 2, 4, 3. Area of triangle is equal to half into determinant of the formula like x1, x2, x3. Full x1 is one column. That is the y1, y2, y3. Then all of them are one. So this is the determinant of the formula. Half into x value full up the line I will take. Next is y value full up the line I will take. Then one will take. All of this is the formula. Now, you can see half into half. First one, you can see 0, 1, 4. Now, second one, you can see 0, 2, 3. Now, 1. This is the formula, area formula. If you put the vertices on the side, this is very easy to put. Now, we can put the row on the side. We can put the row on the side. We can put the row on the side. If you put the first row on the side, we can put the row on the side. So, we can put the row on the side. So, half into half into half into now, 1 into, we can put it in the middle of the row, we can put it in the column, we can put it in the cross multiply, minus it in the cross multiply. We can multiply, minus it in the multiply. We can do 3 minus 8. Half into minus 5, which is equal to minus 2.5. We can do 2. But this is the area of a triangle. The area of a triangle is the formula of the formula. Negative or positive, the answer is positive. Why? The area of a triangle is minus 500 square feet. The area of a triangle is the area of a triangle. That's why it is positive. So, the area of a triangle is equal to 2.5 square units. That's the sum. Thank you.